Hey friends, Pastor Jay Jackson, Trinity Lutheran Church. Nice to have you part of our worship community. It's our weekly announcements. Uh, really all that we have though is we'd love you to keep digging into the Word of God. We are walking through 1 Corinthians 12 right now. Uh, we went through verses 1 through 11 last week, talked a lot about gifts. This week we're going to talk about the body of Christ, um, what it means to be an ear and a toe and, a, and an eyeball. Uh, we're all very important for that. Uh, so we're going to walk through that quite a bit and uh, we look forward to seeing you either online or in person at 9 or at 11. Uh, we're just really glad that you're a part of our worship community. Just know that God loves you, and so do I. Hey, it's Lori Hinman, Life Teams Director at Trinity, and I have a couple announcements for you. Basically, I'm going to talk about Bible studies because they all have either started this week or last week, and so I'll make sure you guys are aware of that. Um, tonight, uh, we are starting a women's study called Scouting the Divine, 630. That one is going to be Zoom only tonight and also next week. Um, and then after that, we will take it one week at a time. Uh, the Tuesday night men's study is called Noah, the man, the ark, the flood. And that one starts at 630. That is online and in person. Uh, you have your choice. Um, let's see. What else do we have? We have Wednesday morning. Uh, that's with Mary Lou Roberts studying the book of Isaiah. Um, that is in person, but it's also recorded and put on our YouTube channel. So that one's available online after the class is over. Uh, we have one on Thursday morning, Sermon on the Mount. It's a women's study. That one, again, is going to be Zoom only this week and next. And then we'll keep you posted after that. Uh, we also have a Thursday night study. That one is Zoom only, <coughs> excuse me, uh, the whole time. Connecting Old Testament prophecies to Jesus. It's called Fulfillment. That's at 7 o'clock uh, on Zoom. Sunday mornings we have two. We have Exploring the Bible. Uh, they have a series called Characters. They are studying the kings uh, in the Old Testament. So that one is Sunday mornings, 10 o'clock. And then there's another one called Conversations with Christ. Uh, that's led by Andrew Kasuf. That's a one-session study. So each week is different. You can drop in uh, anytime you want. That's 10 o'clock also, Sunday mornings. Um, and you can register for any of these Bible studies by emailing me at lhinman at trinityjapa.org. And if you have any questions, I can get you in touch with the leader of each study. All right. Have a great day. Hey, guys. Dave Merritt, Youth and Family Ministries Director here at Trinity Lutheran with this week's announcements. First, our Kid Zone update. We will continue our four-week study on Ruth at both the 10 a.m. and 11 a.m. sermon drop-off. And this week's study, we will discuss Ruth's advice. Who will she give advice to this week? Tune in to find out. Also, a big thank you for those that have decided that who are masking up in KidZone. We really appreciate that. Again, we will continue for all KidZone and youth activities through the month of January. Our family activity for February will be the Baltimore Blast game. On Friday, February 11th, the place is at the, the location, excuse me, is at Towson University um, at 735 on February 11th. And tickets are $30 a person. Parking is free and included in the tickets. Um, if you're interested in tickets, please email me, uh, Dave Merritt, dmerritt at trinityjapa.org. And our youth update. First, our middle school youth and confirmation uh, crossfire will be back next week. Wednesday, January 26th at 6 p.m. Please bring a $5 gift for our fun gift exchange that was supposed to happen in December. Also, for high school youth this week, we will plan on being in person on Sunday, January 23rd, but a little bit of a change up. We are going to serve at the food truck uh, service day as we will go out to the Edgewood area. So if you're interested, um, it's going to be 1245 and we're going to meet uh, at the food truck area behind the church. And we'll probably be here till, to about 5.30. If you're interested, please contact me um, via text or email me, Dave Merritt, dmerritt at trinityjapa.org. That's all I have for this week. I'm Dave Merritt. Have a great week. Hi, I'm Mary Kay Coughlin. I'm the food ministry director here at Trinity. And this is my buddy Donatello. He's here to help me with some announcements this week. So last week I gave you an announcement about um, helping Mike Hinman with uh, doing some upgrades to the shed that we bought for the food closet. That is still on, although um, 
we're still working on the dates. Um, if you uh, think you can help with that, uh, primarily on Saturdays, I believe, is what he's aiming for, please contact Mike Hinman. His email will be, um, should be right here, because <laughs> um, I don't want to um, misspeak. Um, uh, we also, for our food closet challenge, we're still getting um, asking for baby stuff. You know, you're welcome to bring us dog food. We seem also we we seem to be out of dog food. But as far as like the baby stuff is concerned, um, the sizes for the diapers that we need most are twos, threes, fives, sixes, and like pull-ups. So three T, four T, that kind of thing. Um, and then our food truck. I think we have um, enough people to cover packing, but if you'd like to help, please send me an email. But I am looking for people to help us do both deliveries on Saturday and on Sunday. So the delivery on Saturday would be from 3 to 5 p.m. At, in Joppa, and then on Saturday, uh, Sunday, I mean, would be 2 to 4 in Edgewood over at the um, Woodbridge Centerway HOA. So if you can help with any of that, please email me. Um, and uh, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. All right. Have a blessed week.